Hello, World Wide Web. Welcome to the Hanging With Web Show. I'm GW Palmetry. Thank you for logging on and tuning in. If you haven't done it yet, go ahead and subscribe. And while you're there, click that little bell. Get notified when new videos come out. Whenever we have a new artist, author, filmmaker, creator, entertainer, you name it on the show, you'll know about it. We're here at ICCCon 3, hosted by Terrence Baker and the gang at Independent Creators Connection. And we're hanging with independent filmmaker Clinton Landris from Negative Normal Productions. Clinton, thanks for hanging with us, man. Yeah, no really problem. Really appreciate thanks. it. Yeah. Um, well, let's just dive in. You know, the, right. the, the world wants to know what it's like to be an independent filmmaker. Right. Because they're tired of being successful and they want to get into the arts. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, what drew you into uh, being a filmmaker and in general and, and, and Negative Normal? Okay, uh, well... It actually started when I watched uh, the first part or the second part of the Caribbean, and uh, I just—it was the first time I actually looked behind the scenes in a DVD, pretty much. And so I just fell in love with the whole concept the of filmmaking and everything. So like, okay, I have a camera. I'm gonna go shoot a movie. I like him already. <laughs> That's what I said. I have a camera. I'm gonna go shoot yeah. a show. How hard can it be? So um, I actually did a parody of the second. Part of really, and it's it's pretty awful. But it was my first movie. But yeah, the internet loves awful. I know, right? Go watch. I should watch. I should put it on YouTube. That's right. That's my next project. <laughs> <laughs> the internet loves awful. Yeah. Um, especially if we tell them in advance, this is awful. Yeah, I, I don't know why, why that no works. Why. I might say that on this video. This is awful. Yeah. I don't know. Why that um, where did you guys get the name Negative Normal from? So that's actually a funny story. Um, my I wife, like funny yeah. stories. Uh, my wife now. Um, when we were talking and getting to know each other, it was actually at church, um, and the room was like really cold, and so we were all complaining about how cold it is, and she's like, "Yeah, it's it's like negative normal." <laughs> so, negative normal. So I'm like, is a hey, temperature thing, right? It's a temperature. Thing. So these films are so cool; they're <laughs> yeah. negative normal. Mm. Mm, that's what we're going for. I'll, um, I'll stick with it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. What is your current project? What are you guys working on? Right now, not right now because you're in the chair, but right, right. Like when you're not in the chair, where are you running back to finish filming? <laughs> um, tomorrow, we actually start filming our second episode of Back in Black. Okay. Um, first episode on YouTube, of course. Tell, tell, remind the internet what Back in Black. What is the, what is the premise here? Um, it's like a John Wick meets Terminator. It's like this uh, revenge story type thing. Nice. Uh, my character is like a CIA agent that, um, there's just a lot of complicated stuff. You'll have to watch it. <laughs> See? A lot of, uh, but you can. That's the beauty yeah. of the internet, people, that we are living in a digital arts and entertainment paradigm shift. Exactly, yep. Independent creators have a shot now they've never had before. Yes. We can reach an audience. We can reach out and find people. What was the last project you guys worked on? What's out there right now? Um, We're going to put links down below, by the way, so... Right, so Last Days, that's uh, our big thing right now, actually. We have about six episodes so far, um, and then first episode of Back in Black. That was, our, that was actually our previous one that we just did, Back in Black. Awesome, one. awesome. Um, now, you are, what, we, I just did a panel recently at uh, Necronomicon over in Tampa okay. about being in the entertainment industry when you're not in L.A. and you're not in New York. Right. In fact, when you're in Little Bitty, sunny, but not really central, right. in Melbourne, Florida. Right. So, we, uh, how are you faring, and, and where are you getting your talent? How, how, is, how is that coming together, building an, um, building an industry here? Well, it actually helped a lot, because uh, we partnered with 9.9 .9 Comics. It's a local comic shop in Melbourne on uh -huh. Sarno. Um, we partnered with them, and he's been a great way to gather people like interest people to okay. be in the films. Um, so, <laughs> the most unusual spot to film was just this uh, construction site, but it was just this random off-road of just dirt. 
so we just parked a bunch of cars that looked abandoned, and we used that for episode six of uh, Last Days. Wow. And it worked out Fantastic. pretty great. <laughs> um, so how long have you been doing this now? I've been doing it for 11 years. 11 years? Yes. Wow. Uh, what is what is the most memorable thing you can think of that is happening during filming? Most memorable, craziest, just kind of mm. you'll never forget moment on set. Um, that's a good question because we have a lot of them. <laughs> They're in the movies, right? He's, you know, yeah, you just, just got to watch. Them. <laughs> um, oh, that's a tough question, actually. There's so, just so many to choose from. I, just, huh? I don't know. Yeah. It's funny because we we don't okay, get. I tell you what, let's, yeah. let's do this. Yeah, yeah. Because being a creative artist is is a labor of love. You right. have to love it. Yes. So, let, high point, low point. So let's let's play a little okay. high point, low point. What's the high point of of being an independent filmmaker for you? Uh, so but, far, right. So far, because the Oscar is going to get up the road. It'll be the high <laughs> yeah, point. Right. But right now, uh, while point. he waits for the call. Yep. Call. <laughs> exactly. Um, high point actually is finding good location. Uh huh. Because that's like really hard in Brevard. It's just to find good location. Like once we find that perfect location, it's just like something that just sailing. talks to you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Eleven years. Eleven years. Low point. Low point. Just oh my god, what the hell am I doing? Low point. Yeah. So uh, it's when all your friends move. You have like <laughs> nobody to film with. And so oh. it was just me for actually a while. Wow. So I had to do all the editing. and Now I know why I do an interview show, because I make new friends. Right? Over and <laughs> over and over again. <laughs> yeah. And never running out of people who want to be on camera, because there's lots of authors and artists yeah. and all these guys out here. They, Some of them don't want it. They stand behind the camera and watch like six, three episodes be filmed before they're like, right. yeah, maybe I'll go over there now. <laughs> he doesn't look that mean. Yeah. They've never met my children. So, uh, you know. Nice. So... Okay, so we've talked about your career in, in, as a filmmaker, your upcoming productions. We are going to throw links down below in the description awesome. so people can click on over there. We hope you'll do that. Look at the, open that description. <laughs> click, 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 click. We, we want you to go check people out on, uh, on our show. Yes. Now, this is the portion of the show that I have called clickbait. Clickbait. I need a headline. Okay. I need a headline. Right. And to get a headline, I said to the girls, go on out and find me the most bizarre, crazy, wackiest, weirdest questions on the internet. Okay. I like those. I like those. Now, I appreciate bring it. them to me, mix them up, and don't tell me in advance what they are. Okay. So I'm going to look up there, and All we're right. going to get whatever she pulled from the pile. It could be good, <laughs> could be bad, could be meat, nice. could be cake, we don't know. All right. And during the zombie apocalypse, what are you going to miss the most? Oh my gosh. Uh... Reese's. Reese's. Excellent answer. <laughs> Excellent answer. Are, wait, are we talking about cups or pieces? Cups, for sure. Cups, for sure. Okay. Pieces. It, I, I have to weigh in yeah. there. You know, it's, it, it's a, uh, cups cups came first. It's all the yeah, way. Yeah. That's right. E.T. doesn't change what we grew up on. <laughs> yeah, okay. Right. An orangutan walks in holding a big stick, wearing a top hat. What does he say to you? Oh, my gosh. Complete with hand gestures, folks. He's a New Jersey <laughs> yeah. orangutan. It's got the... Yes. Anyway. <laughs> all right. So, I tell people all the time, I grew up in the 80s. Yeah. The 80s and 90s, we had the best soundtracks to our lives. I know. They were know. awesome. Yes. Favorite 80s or 90s jam. Jam. I'm Comes on the radio. You're still cruising to it, man. Everything Michael Jackson. Everything that Michael Jackson. That is my top artist right there. The, you can't beat that. No. You can't beat that. Billie Jean beat it. Mm. Sweet. Every time. That's what I'm saying. You know, <laughs> we, we, we jammed to life. Yes. yes. In those decades. If you joined the circus, what would you be? I would be an independent uh, filmmaker. Feel, <laughs> or a jugglist. A juggler. I can juggle. If juggler. You All right. Anything juggle? Uh, where can people out on the internet find you next? Are you going to be at another con coming up? Another appearance? Where are you going to um, be? I will definitely be at Space Coast Comic, uh, Space Coast Comic Con. I'll actually have a panel there as well. Awesome, talking so. about filmmaking. Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, now you're also acting in your film. Yeah. Um, favorite job? In front of the camera, or behind the camera? Um, I'd probably say behind. Or, no, no, no. 
Acting. Acting. I love to act. That's, love to that's act. some good stuff. You step into somebody else's skin yeah. for a little while. Exactly. Yeah. We got to wrap it up. That was quick. Wow. As we do that, we're <laughs> going to say thank you to our partners and our friends at Something Unique Magazine, the Space Coast Comics, Wordfire Press, Famous Faces and Funnies, Off the Chain Radio with author Yvonne Mason. I'm GW Palmature. We are at ICC Con 3 hanging with independent filmmaker Clinton Landris. Negative Normal Productions, folks. Check out the links down below. Remember, folks, subscribe right yes. now. Right, oh, just you, you. Push the button. <laughs> yes, please. That's all you got to do. And click the little bell over there so you can come back over and over again. Log on, tune in, and see who we're hanging with next.